Do y'all know how hard it is to record a video when your kids are out of school? It's not fun. Not fun at all. <laughs> hey guys, this is Matt with Smart Safes, the Liberty Safe Store uh, out of North Augusta, South Carolina and our location in Charleston, South Carolina, serving the low country now. So we're covering over half of South Carolina and a lot of Georgia too. Um, so uh, real excited about that. Uh, this video you're fixing to watch is uh, where Liberty took us out to Utah, all the dealers for the 2018 dealer form uh, to show us their new designs um, and do some torture tests uh, to show you how our safes are really performing. Uh, a lot of companies will go out there and um, do videos that uh, their highline safes versus entry level safes of another manufacturer. Uh, we don't do that. Uh, we're, we're doing apples to apples. So we're going to take our 60 minute safe against a competitor's 60 minute safes. They're going to be, uh, you know, typical of, you know, that, that how that competitor builds their 60 minute fire rate of safes to our 60 minute fire rate of safes and show you what the differences are. Uh, how they perform. Um, so real excited, just kind of wanted to get an intro to this video to, to tell you that, to tell you that none of these safes were, were mutilated in any way to um, make the test show different. These are our middle of the road model, the Colonial Series. It's a 60 minute fire rating, so we're not testing our presidential or our Lincolns or national security models. We're testing Colonial. You know, a safe that starts, comes in at, you know, 1200 bucks. Um, and um, so against competitor safes that are the same 60 minute fire rating because uh, that's what most people look at when they're looking at safes or they're, they're trying to compare fire ratings to fire ratings. Uh, so we want to show you why Liberty Safe makes the best product out there on the market that your money can buy. I hope you enjoy this video. Any questions, post a comment down below. I'll be happy to answer them. We're going to do today in terms of torture testing. As you know, what makes a great safe is a safe body with a strong door. And so today we want to show how strong our body is, our two piece roll form system, and that'll be a colonial. And then we're going to compare that to a competitor safe with a three piece body. Then the second test we're going to do is back at the factory. We're going to do a pull test on the doors. So the combination of a strong box with the strong safe door is what makes one great safe. And so today we want to do that. And the first one is we're going to blow these two safes sky high. Fire in the hole. Three, Three, two, two one. one. Fire! Guys, this was 10 pounds. We did 10 pounds in one, 15 in the other. There's your competitor from China. Let's go see what the Liberty did first. The new flat bar system with 15 pounds. Liberty safe. Nice. Go ahead. Well, all right. Hey, it look at the welds. 
Rip the steel. Check out that <laughs> well, man. Look at that. All right, let's turn that safe over. Let's take a look. Oh, check right it there, out. Right there. Woo! All held together. Good fun. Look at that. That door Where's Jeremy? I want to give him is intact. And just to show y'all what you're looking at here, uh, this is the competitor safe. Uh, you can see they don't do that fully welded system. Uh, they, they weld the outside and then they grind the majority of their welds off uh, to give you a good finish. So this is what happens when you do that. And that's what you get with a lot of your import safes. Again, this was 10 pounds in this imported safe and 15 pounds in the Liberty safe, all set up the same way. Again, nothing was changed on them, and you see how it blew apart. There was a metal plate under each one. Uh, so this just goes to show you that uh, the safes are not as strong as they, they say they are. Here's the second part of the video, guys. Um, this is the hydraulic pull test on the doors. Uh, we're going to test three different safes, two competitors and a Liberty safe, all 60-minute fire rated safes built different ways and just see how strong they really are. Uh, so y'all enjoy this second portion of the video. Ready? Oh 
Oh yeah. yeah. Okay. We're gonna hit a maximum pressure. Um, let's start with 10,000. How's that sound? We'll at least hit 9,100. Make sure it's as good as the last thing. Go ahead, Jonathan. Here we go. <laughs> We're up to 6,000, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, whoa, 12, 12. So we've hit, oh, there's 12, there's 13. Woo! All right, should we stop it? No, no, no. Rip it off. Let's try 13, 14, woo! Oh my goodness. Man alive. I said wow. I was going to go to 12. You don't want us to know, do you? I don't want you to know, really, yeah. <laughs> All right, Jonathan, give me a little more pressure. Whoa, there's 15. What? Liberty oh. safe. Keep going, Jamie. Liberty safe. Number one. Twice. Uh, twice what number, safe number one. And at least, what, 50% more than, than safe number two. Liberty safe. Test number three should have been number one. So let me tell you, this colonial safe is one tough safe. And we hope that you'll sell the living dickens out of it. So have a great time. Thank you so much. Nothing like liberty. Where's All right, guys. So there you have it. This was our trip out to uh, Utah. Uh, for Liberty Safe, where we tested the new flat bar design bolts. Uh, you see here that the, the locking bolts on this model, imported safe, uh, just sheared off. Um, how they build theirs, they're, they're punched in kind of like a rivet, and they just shear right off. Um, so, you know, I know a lot of people are going to say, oh, yeah, I'm just going to put a hydraulic press in my house and, you know, let someone open the door. This test wasn't about that. You know, you see people prying doors open. Uh, you see them um, uh, doing that with crowbars and all that. And you can't get steady numbers with that. So we set it up so you have, we take all the variables out of it is basically what we did. So every safe was treated the same way. They were, all three were operable safes. Uh, open the doors, close the doors before we laid them down. And this is how they perform under the, the hydraulic pressure of prying the door versus just killing a bunch of guys with some pry bars. And, you know, I'm not saying that these are, are weak safes or they're bad. You know, 9,600 pounds is a lot. 6,900 pounds is a lot. But the Liberty Door never even opened, never even started to open at 15,000 PSI. So that just goes to prove our new flat bar system that we have, that we're implementing on all of our safes, is one tough safe. Guys, appreciate you watching. Watching, I know it was kind of a long video. I appreciate you staying with me. Uh, we hope to be seeing you soon. Smart Safes, the Liberty Safe Store. Thank y'all.